last year, um, in addition to getting to do falsettos, we also had the great privilege of getting to record it for, uh, for PBS, which, thank you. Um, which was so exciting because as a kid, um, I am from Nebraska, Todd is from Nebraska, and we both were talking about this as we were putting together the show, that those PBS shows were really our window to Broadway because we didn't really have access to, we didn't have access at all to, to New York or to Broadway. So those PBS specials were, were very important, so it was very humbling and very exciting to get to be a part of one. Um, and along those lines, Todd and I, you know, we were talking about, you know, which one was our favorite. And um, we agreed, much like most other sane people on the planet, that it was Into the Woods. Um, yes. We knew we wanted to do something from Into the Woods, but I was, it's hard to pick because there's so many great songs in there. So we decided that maybe it was best just to give you a tiny glimpse of what 13-year-old Andy Rannells looked like in his bedroom mirror. <laughs> it's because of you there's a giant in our midst and my wife is dead. But it isn't my fault I was given those beans you persuaded me to trade away my cow for beans and without those beans there had been no stock to get up to the giant in the first place. Wait a minute, magic beans for a cow so old that you had to tell a lie to sell it which you told were they worthless beans were they oversold? Oh and tell us who persuaded you to steal that gold. See it's your fault. No. Yes it's your fault. No. Yes it is. It's not. It's true. Wait a minute but I only stole the gold to get my cow back from you so it's your fault. Yes. No it isn't. I'd have kept those beans but our house was cursed. She made us get our cow to get the curse reversed. It's your father's fault that the curse got placed and the place got cursed in the first place. Oh, then it's his fault. No, yes, it's his fault. So, yes, it is. It's his, I guess. Wait a minute, though I chopped down the beanstalk. Right, that's clear. But without any beanstalk, then what's queer is how did the second giant get down here in the first place? Second place. Yes, how? Hmm. Well, who had the other bean? The other bean? The other bean? You pocketed the other bean? I didn't. Yes, I did. So it's your. No, it isn't because I gave it to my wife. Then it's hers. No, it isn't. Then whose is it? Wait a minute. She exchanged that bean to obtain your shoe. So the one who knows what happened to the bean is you. You mean that old bean that your wife, oh dear, but I never knew, and so I threw it, don't look here, see, it's her fault, yes, it's her fault, and it isn't mine at all, but what, well, if he hadn't gone back up again, we were needy, you were greedy, did you need that hen, but I got it from my mother, then it's her fault, then, yes, and what about the harp in the third place, the harp, yes, she went and dared me to, I dared you to, she dared me to, she said that I was scared to, she dared me, no, I didn't, your fault, wait a minute, you hadn't dared him to, and you would let the harp alone, we wouldn't be in trouble in the first place, well, if she hadn't raised him in the first place, it was you who raised the beans in the first place, you're responsible. You're the one to blame. It's your fault. No more questions, please. No more tests. Comes the day you say what for, please. No more. No more riddles. No more jests. No more curses you can't undo. Left by fathers you never knew. No more quests. No more feelings. Time to shut the door. Just no more. Running away, let's do it. Free from the ties that bind. No more despair or burdens to bear out there in the yonder. Running away, go to it. Where did you have in mind? Have to take care unless there's a where You'll only be wandering blind. Just more question. Different kind. Where are we to go? Where are we ever to go? Running away, let's do it. Why sit around resigned? Trouble is sun, the farther you run, the more you feel undefined by what you have left 
undone. And more, what you left behind. No more giants waging war. Can't we just pursue our lives with our children and our wives till that happy day arrives? How do you ignore all the witches, all the curses, all the wolves, all the lies, the false hopes, the goodbyes, the reverses. All the wondering what even worse is still in store. All the children, all the giants, no 